Democratic Senate candidate John Fetterman paid a visit to Temple on Saturday alongside State Representative Malcolm Kenyatta and several others. The rally was held at the Howard Giddes Student Center to encourage young people and North Philadelphia residents to vote. Electing John Fetterman to the Senate will make him that 51st vote to overturn uh, the Dobbs decision to codify Roe v. Wade into law. Fetterman and his allies spoke on key issues surrounding the election, namely inflation and reproductive rights. If elected, Fetterman has promised to work to stop price gouging, make health care more accessible, and allow access to abortion. Fetterman also claimed his opponent, Dr. Oz, is trying to buy his way to the Senate and is disconnected from the Pennsylvania working class. You can't fight inflation if you don't understand how it's affecting working families. Oz doesn't get it, he doesn't even understand the price of groceries. With the senatorial race narrowing ahead of election day, Fetterman's main path to victory is a big win in Philadelphia. Experts predict that he'll need at least 85% of the vote to win. Well, this is probably the election that's going to determine whether or not we can have future elections. We have Republicans in Harrisburg, but also in D.C., who want to make it as difficult as possible for young people to vote. The rally comes just a week before Donald Trump plans to campaign with Dr. Oz in western Pennsylvania on November 5th. On the same day, President Joe Biden and Barack Obama will be in Philadelphia to support Fetterman's campaign. Reporting for Temple Update, I'm Caleb Jackson.